morning everyone that's the ac blowing me air around it's uh five to nine on saturday already pete said they'll be coming around nine ish figure get up get showered get ready coffee number two woke up with a wicked headache number one the humidity and number two um all the lifting and carrying yesterday and always ends up with a headache the day after but anyway coffee number two you're going to enjoy it enjoy your saturday whatever it is you're doing stay cool and uh we'll speak to you in a Where, bit where's everything going they've just picked up that and the thing over here and then they're coming back they're going to go put that away and then come back for this and then downstairs they've taken the big square thing in the living room that had all our photos in and they're taking the kitchen table today. Luna, this is the beginning of our new life, buddy. And so it goes. I don't think we're gonna be missed over here. I really don't. Do you think we will be? It's hot, isn't it? Alexa, what's the humidity level today? Alexa, what's the humidity level today? Right now, the humidity is 80%. 80, Luna. It's been worse. Currently, the humidity is 80%. What? Alexa, what's the temperature right now? Right now, it's 80 degrees. Oh, it's only 80 degrees. Only 80 degrees, Luna. Okay, the next set is gone. Floors. We told them they're out the floors though. We wanted to have all the floors redone and we never did. So now that's gone. So everything's gone from up here that they're taking for now, I think. Unless he's gonna take one of those bedside tables. Um, he might, I'll see. He said he's gonna come over every night and take stuff. So anyway, I'll just on my hands and knees getting all the massive dust bunnies that are bigger than my dog <laughs> from over here. That's as good as it gets for now. The door is open Ooh. For like to it's hot, but it's not very hot. So things are starting to accumulate up here now, which I'm gonna to have to get rid of again. Yeah, the house is gonna look a mess from now till um, move out day. The table's gone, all the boxes that he did, except the cleaning products, has gone. Center table's gone. He wanted the recliner, it was his. See how different? Our carpet is, it's not like it's even dirty because we shampoo it, but that's been preserved underneath the uh, thing. In here, all the boxes have gone that have been done so far. And some of the small pictures, that's Ashley's baby clothes to take somewhere. Um, she's gonna empty this table, put all her crafting stuff away. So yeah. And then in her room, she got rid of three bags of garbage. You have to excuse the mess. Um, and she's cleaning up all her stuff. So, yep, we're getting there. Very sad. Very sad indeed. That's where we're at. So no Instacarting today. It's almost four, I think. Um, but he's going to come back tomorrow and do stuff in the basement. So I think tomorrow we'll be out and do Instacarting. And there you have it, our little update. Hey guys, I think I'm going to end the vlog because I'm not doing anything. I tried to lay down a bit because my back started spasm, but even that wasn't comfortable. So back up again. Um, that lasted about 15, 20 minutes. Um, but yeah, it's just been a day. My arms ache. They feel like jelly because of... I carried some more bags of garbage down, a chair. This is Ashley's chair, because she ended up getting a gaming chair because my two chairs were shot. So the black, the white one went out the other day. Someone took it uh, when I put it out for bulk pickup. And now my other one, oh, excuse me, um, is down on the back deck, ready to go out this week. Pete took a bunch of the bags of garbage that I did from in the room last night he's put them at his place because he's gonna he went to take them to i hate saying the dump that's what it's called we in england call it the tip i think but anyway um he missed it by a couple of minutes they were shutting 
So he's got them at his mum's outside and he's going to take them Monday, I think, because I think they close tomorrow. I don't know. It's in Greenwich somewhere. Um, apart from that, that's about it, really. It's just been another clean up, clean out. Get the furniture out. Let's get this show on the road. Um, I've been checking out um, flights. They're quite expensive to fly, a bit more than I thought, just for three days. But I will look again. Uh, I'm getting overwhelmed, so Pete wants to know when I'm moving out, blah, 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 blah. And I'm like, well, can I get the closing date confirmed? Because what he's panicking about is the next two Tuesdays are the only two Tuesdays we can get bulk out. and There's a lot more to go. So he's worried because it's the ninth, the last one. And he goes, and you're not going to have anything to sit in, sit on. I don't know. I, I, we got into a bit of a blur, but uh, I'm like, I just feel pressure again. I'm constantly feeling pressure. I'm feeling pressure about Luna um, getting her down there with me. Um, I'm feeling a bit of pressure from everything. So when I get over pressured, I just shut down, which is what I've done. And then I will rethink it, regroup. And once I start talking to Ashley afterwards, I know I'll be fine. I'm, I'm still excited about going. It's still the plan. But it's just, you know, it's just a lot coming at me at once. And you want answers. And I don't have your answers for you right this second. We only talked about it yesterday. It was yesterday when they were trying to change everything. Um, nothing's much has changed from last night to 2 o'clock this afternoon, you know. Mm. It's almost like, oh, I don't know. I could get into it, but I got a bit ratty because I just feel like I'm in a predicament and I've got to figure out all these solutions. And it's a lot. <laughs> I'm still, blah, it's a lot at once. But, you know, again, this is just me getting it off my chest so I could get on with it and release it. Mum used to always tell me, it's not your problem, it's theirs. So... That's what I'm telling myself. But really, at the end of the day, this one is my problem because i got to find somewhere to live and <coughs> and move and get there and sign up and apply and blah, blah, blah. But And get a car when I get down there because we both agree this car will not make the drive. Um, it's not worth it to fix it. The amount that it's going to cost to fix it is pretty much a down payment on another one. Um, so I don't know. Come on, let's have something change. It just, it's a lot of frustration at the moment because it's just a lot of planning in two weeks. Tomorrow's the 30th, isn't it? Is it the 30th? Yeah. No, 29th. Alexa, what's the date? Oh, here's the 29th, so tomorrow is the 30th, so, oh, yeah. Oh, it's, the t yep, 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 yep. So it's literally two weeks till closing of the house. It's two weeks Monday. Oh, I'm not pressure. No pressure. Um. <laughs> oh, dear, oh, dear. We'll get there. We will, we will always get there. Everything will fall into place, she says. Fingers crossed. I did check with my realtor. I said, do I have to be at the closing? And she said, no. The lawyer can either have the papers drawn up beforehand and I can sign them or I can give Pete power of attorney. I wanted to be there because if anything came up and a decision had to be made, I wanted to be part of that decision. So I still might be there, but I was just so annoyed this afternoon. I thought, let me just see what my options are. So that's that. Anyway, let me go edit this. Say goodnight. I hope you've all had a brilliant Saturday, whatever it is you, get, you did today. I hope it was a good one and we'll definitely see you tomorrow. Take care, guys. Stay safe. And if you haven't, please subscribe.